I'm not a proponent that everything needs to be a big fancy name brand or, uh, you know, expensive, okay? We lose these all the time. They get left here, left there. They break all the time. Even when you buy expensive ones, they may or may not hold up. And then sometimes, you know, when the batteries fail, sometimes they'll, they'll do okay when you replace the battery, sometimes not. They just... These are very cheap components so, or tools. So I do actually suggest just getting the cheap ones. And I have another uh, thing I'm going to add to this. Uh, your standard uh, thermometers do not fit in a PT port. Now, I've referred to these in the past as Pete's plugs or Pete's ports. I've actually learned recently uh, in the last few months that the uh, the proper name for a Pete's, which is actually PT, is pressure temperature. I didn't know that. Uh, until somebody pointed it out to me. So I appreciate that. But these fit in there. So a set of water gauges. I'll cover this more in a second. But this is an official uh, Pete's needle. Okay. You can see how small it is. Now they also make a little bit of a larger one uh, for a different, for a larger style of, of PT plug. But this is the official standard needle that you'll see on most systems. This meat thermometer fits in there really well and it's accurate enough within a couple of degrees that it served me well i've not had it had issues with it and so uh they're easy to calibrate but honestly most of the time by the time these are starting to get out of calibration they're already pretty well wore out to begin with and i just end up getting a new set it's not a big deal